Live from the world's capital markets, here are the financial headlines brought to you by Vantage. Hello and welcome to Wednesday's financial news. Stay with us for more market headlines. US job openings rose in May after posting outsized declines in the prior two months, but the trend remained consistent with an easing in labor market conditions that could pave the way for the Federal Reserve to cut interest rates this year. Over half of the top American hedge funds have disclosed exposure to newly launched spot Bitcoin ETFs, as BTC slash USD has significantly outformed major stocks and indexes. 13 out of the top 25 United States hedge funds had owned Bitcoin ETFs by the end of Q1 2024. Eurozone inflation eased last month, but a crucial services component remained stubbornly high, likely fueling concern among some European Central Bank policymakers that domestic price pressures could stay at elevated levels. The Bitcoin dollar pair plummeted 1.4% in the last session. The stochastic RSI indicates an overbought market. The gold dollar pair made a minor downwards correction in the last session, dropping 0.1%. The stochastic indicator is giving a positive signal. The last session saw NIO shares gain 1.6%. The MACD is giving a positive signal. The Aussie got a slight bump of 0.1% against the dollar in the last session. The stochastic RSI indicates an overbought market. Australia's retail sales will be released at 1.30 GMT, Japan's Jibun Bank Services PMI at 0.30 GMT, Spain's Unemployment Change at 7 GMT. The US ISM Services PMI will be released at 14 GMT, Japan's Foreign Bond Investment at 23.50 GMT, the US ADP Employment Change at 12.15 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed Wednesday's Market Outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join us tomorrow morning for the latest news and events from the financial markets.